So you want to start running? No. Excellent. Running is a great sport to get into. Running can help you lose weight. Huh? <laughs> and it will make you feel good. Unlikely. It can be a social activity. Come on, just try it for me. All right, for you. Stand up straight, look ahead, and start off slow. <coughs> Let's try this again. Start with a leisurely paced walk. Now gain some speed. Don't force yourself to go too fast. Just go at a comfortable pace. You are new to this. Huh? Huh? Uh. The only way you'll build the stamina is to push yourself to run longer and faster each time you run. Try to go running at the same time every day. <laughs> Make sure you pay attention to the path while you run. Watch out for puddles! Uh. Don't push yourself too hard. Congratulations! You've become a full-blown runner. It is now time to test your skills. How about you enter a race? It costs money to enter a race. The day of the race has arrived. Time to put all your training to the test. When running in a race, it's very important to decide where you will stand in the crowd. You will want to stand approximately where you think those around you will run at the same pace as you. The front of the crowd is where all the fast people are. If you start here, you may find yourself left in the dust. You also may find yourself getting in people's way. In the back of the crowd, you may find the opposite issue. You are much faster than everyone else, and you must push your way through the crowd, which will inevitably slow your time down. It's best to start in the middle of the crowd. Running in a race is different than running for pleasure. You won't know the course, so you will have to follow those around you. You will want to avoid distractions. When running in a race, you usually push yourself harder than you normally would. That is fine, but just remember to pace yourself. Hmm? You still have another mile Whoa. to go. You're here, the final stretch. All of your running has led up to this point. You can see the finish line. Here comes a challenger. Who will finish first? Where is Jeff getting this energy? Oh my, the challenger has this. It's neck and neck. Jeff takes the outside. The challenger is on the inside. Who's on the other side? Another challenger has entered the fray. Oh, he's tripped, he's gone. Jeff digs deep. He's giving her all he's got, but she seems uninterested. She refuses to succumb to his advances. Oh, but here he goes, the finishing move. Jeff from behind must take the dive. The leap of faith, he dives head first. Will he make it? Will he make it? It's a photo finish, and Jeff takes it by a hair. Congratulations, you finished your first race. You set your mind to a goal, and it looks like you even made a new friend. Looking a little thinner, I might add. Don't you feel good? Yeah, I feel good. Having just finished a race, you will have a euphoric high. All your hard work paid off. Aren't you glad you started running? I guess. The morning after a race is always difficult. If you push yourself sufficiently, you will experience what we will call the runner's reward. Welcome to full body soreness. Doesn't it feel great? Uh-uh.